And I'm going to teach you a game as a big group, but then I'm going to split us up into smaller groups to play it because it's more fun to play in smaller groups. Uh, this is a really cool game. Uh, Mike and I played this one together. Um, it's called Bing Bang Buzz. And the way this game works is I'm going to start off, and uh, we're going to go to my left, okay, so Lloyd's going to be the next person, simply counting. So it'll be one, two, three, four. Okay, now let's stop. Now, the game comes in because anytime we get to a number seven, any number that has a seven in it, or any multiple of seven, we're going to say bing. So it will go one, two, three, four, five, six, bing. Eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, bing. 15, 16, bing. 18, 19, 20, bing. Okay, Why so that's kind of. 16 a bing? 17. Because it has a 7 in it. Yeah. Oh. So any number that has a 7 in it, or any number that has a multiple of 7. All right? And we'll play this one kind of slow to start off with. Let's just kind of warm up with this. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, bing, 7, 8. Oh. That's okay. That's okay. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, bing, 15, 16, bing, 18, 19, 20, bing, 22, 23. Four, five, six, big. Eight. That's a big. That's a big as oh, well. Eight. That's okay. So you see how I can start getting complicated the further you go up. Now the challenge is, is to see how high you can get your number to go. All right. Now we're gonna um, throw two more variations into it. When I split you up into your group, I'm gonna let you determine how you want to play it. Whether you want to play Bing, Bing Bang or bing bang buzz, uh, because it gets harder as you go along. Now, the bang comes in because any number with a five in it, or any number that is a multiple of five, you would say bang. So it would be one, two, three, four, bang, six, bing, eight, nine, oh, bang. Oh. The buzz <laughs> comes in for any number that has a three, or a multiple of three. So it'd be one, two, buzz, four, bang, six, bing, eight, buzz, bang. Mm -hmm. I think. Now, uh, when I played this game with Mike, he did a really cool thing, and, and uh, I'm going to teach it to you guys, that when you mess up, that everybody else in the group will say, hey there, Mike, why are you buzzing? And so that's what they would say if you messed up. And then you'd have to start back over one. So part of the challenge is that every time you mess up, you have to go back to one. So you're trying to see how far you can get. So let's all practice, and let's say that Mike messed up. So, hey there, Mike, why are you buzzing? 13. 14. Hey 